This is a Vortex Backbone Roof Rack System training video. I will show you how to fit this roof rack on a Jeep Wrangler 4 door 4 wheel drive hardtop. First you will need 3 Vortex bars part number VA150B, 3 boxes of RLCP30 leg kits, 3 packs of VAFK2 and a box of backbone components. Please check parts list in the fitting instructions to make sure you have all the components. Use a M8 20mm hex bolt, spring washer and flat washer to assemble support struts. Check part number to identify left and right side supports. Attach the bracket fixture plate to the top of the internal support using an M8 washer and nylock nut. Repeat the process for the opposing support strut. Remove the hard top and place onto a stable, safe working area. Align the rear bracket with the rear of the hard top. Line the bracket flush with the contour of the hard top. With brackets aligned, spot mark the bracket's position. It is very important to be accurate when marking. Align the center brackets against the rain gutter of the hard top. With the center bracket aligned, spot mark the bracket's position. Place the front bracket template onto the hard top. Sit the template in the rain gutter and align the template with the end of the rain gutter. Finally, spot mark the hard top using the template. Use the marks closest to the gutter. Using a 3mm drill bit, spot drill all previously spot marked positions. Angle drill when completing. All holes should pass through both skin on the hard top. Using a 6.5mm drill bit, drill out the rear and middle spot drilled sections on the hard top. On the front holes only, using a step drill bit, open out spot holes to 18mm. Then 16mm from the bottom. Now take the front brackets and the corresponding foam pads and remove the protective strips, fit adhesive to the bracket as indicated and they're now ready for installation. Repeat the process for the center and rear brackets. Hold the support strut in place. Fastening the rear bracket and the support strut together with the M6 countersunk screw, M6 x 19 flat washer, M6 nylock nut, Hold the nylock nuts in place with a 10mm wrench, tighten from the outside with a 4mm allen key. Repeat the process for the centre bracket. With rear bracket now secure, drill out the top fixture point with a 6mm drill bit. Use a M6 socket heavy duty bolt with an o-ring, a flat washer, a nylock nut to fix the bracket. Tighten the supports with a 5mm allen key. The top support will require a 13mm wrench. Place the front bracket onto the hard top. Using M6 x 20 hex head bolts, spring washers, flat washer, attach the backing plate and material support to the front bracket from inside the hard top. Tighten with a 4mm allen key. Locate the zipper which conceals the Jeep's bracket fixture point. Unzip to reveal fixture point. Remove existing hardware with the 13mm socket wrench. Put the Jeep bracket into place and refit the hardware with the 13mm socket wrench. Repeat the process for the opposing side. Rezip protective cover, tuck any excess material under and out of the way. Referring to manufacturer's instructions, place the hardtop back onto the Jeep. Replace the hardware removed on both sides inside the hardtop. Open VA150B box and remove vortex bar. Remove end caps to access items found inside. Measurement strips, VGS rubber strips and a key is stored inside the bar cavity. Please remove all contents and fit prior to use. Insert VGS rubber strips into the top of the crossbar. RLCP30 and VAFK2 kits are the legs and spacers used for Vortex crossbar. Assemble the leg and spacer using the M6x40mm security screw channel nut, spring washer, flat washer provided. Slide the channel nut into the vortex bar, finger tighten, repeat the process for the opposing leg, repeat this for the other crossbars. Peel off the white paper under the legs and place them onto the brackets on the Jeep's backbone. Attach the leg to the bracket with M6 by 30mm hex bolt, M10 spring washer, top pad and base pad. Tighten an M6 security screw to 3 to 4 newton meters. 
Adjust crossbar overhang to be equal on both sides, then tighten M6 crossbar bolts to 3 to 4 Newton meters. Cut the underbar strips to length and insert into the crossbars. Insert end cap and use secure core key to lock it. Repeat the process for the opposing leg and then give it a solid shake to check the crossbar is secure. Repeat this for the other crossbars. The Jeep Wrangler Backbone roof rack system are ready to use.